Dengue is a febrile mosquito-borne illness caused by infection with one of the four dengue viruses transmitted by Aedes aegypti or Aedes albopictus mosquitoes during the taking of a blood meal. Infection may be asymptomatic or present with a broad range of clinical manifestations including a mild febrile illness to a life-threatening shock syndrome. Classification In 1997, the World Health Organization published a classification scheme describing three categories of symptomatic dengue virus infection. Dengue fever, dengue hemorrhagic fever, and dengue shock syndrome. Dengue fever, also known as breakbone fever, is an acute febrile illness defined by presence of fever and two or more of the headache Retro, retro orbital or ocular pain, arthralgia, rash, myalgia and bone pain, hemorrhagic manifestations like positive torniquet test, petechiae formation, purpura, ecchymosis, epistaxis, gum bleeding, blood in emesis, urine or stool, or vaginal bleeding, and leukopenia. What is dengue hemorrhagic fever? The cardinal features of dengue hemorrhagic fever is plasma leakage due to increased vascular permeability as evidenced by hemoconcentration 20 or more than 20% rise in hematocrit above the baseline, pleural effusion or ascites. Dengue hemorrhagic fever is also characterized by fever, thrombocytopenia and hemorrhagic manifestation. The presence of intense abdominal pain, persisting vomiting and marked restlessness or lethargy, especially coinciding with defervescence, should alert the clinician to possible impending dengue shock syndrome. The criteria for dengue hemorrhagic fever comprise a narrow definition that does not encompass all patients with clinically severe or complicated dengue infection. According to the guidelines, a dengue hemorrhagic fever diagnosis requires all of the following be present. Fever or history of acute fever lasting 2-7 to seven days, occasionally biphasic, hemorrhagic tendencies evidenced by at least one of the following, a positive torniquet test, petechiae chymosis or purpura formation, bleeding from mucosa in GIT injection sites or other locations, hematemesis or melina, thrombocytopenia, 1 lakh cells per millimeter of cube or less, evidence of plasma leakage due to increased vascular permeability manifested by at least one of the following. A rise in hematocrit equal to or greater than 20% above average for age, sex, and population. A drop in hematocrit following volume replacement treatment equal to or greater than 20% of baseline. Signs of plasma leakage such as pleural effusion, ascites, and hypoproteinemia. Dengue shock syndrome DSS, consists of dengue hemorrhagic fever with marked plasma leakage that leads to circulatory collapse or shock as evidenced by narrowing pulse pressure or hypotension. For diagnosis of dengue shock syndrome, all of the above four criteria for dengue hemorrhagic fever must be present plus evidence of circulatory failure manifested by rapid and weak pulse, narrow pulse pressure, 20 mm of mercury or manifested by hypotension for age. Hypotension is defined to be a systolic pressure 80 mm of mercury for those less than 5 years of age or 90 mm of mercury for those greater than or equal to 5 years of age. Cold, clammy skin and restlessness.